Welcome to Filament. Uh, we're taking a look at a light-based puzzle game uh, with some freeform movement and a bit of a story. Uh, as you can see in the lower right, this is a preview build, so the game is not finished. So let's go ahead and pick up where I left off. Uh, this is just right after the introduction. So we're going to get a bit of story here. After we solve some puzzles. And I like how, uh, you know, like pressing a button is an interaction in terms of solving the puzzle. You can see at the bottom how many puzzles we have to solve. Would you look at that? An intruder. intruder. You're a little more disheveled than your traditional knight in shining armor. I was hoping to be saved by someone without mustard stains on their dungarees, for one. But as you might be my only ticket off this vessel, I'll make do. I've been trapped in this cockpit for a few weeks now, and this is the first time anything on this damn console has perked up. Whatever you did to those anchors on your way in, it seemed to help. Mind taking a look at that one over by the wall? Please, and thank you. So let's solve some more puzzles. So in kind of a Tron way, you can't overlap on, <clears throat> on your own line, so... So it's important to kind of think about where you're going, where you want to be, and not get in your own way. And if you make a mistake, you can rewind. Can't jump over yourself. Definitely not gonna work. What am I doing? Do I even need to do that? Do you feel important? Look at that. Solving puzzles. Thank you. 
thing. Crest over. But if I do that, then I block myself out. Feels like a mistake. I go here and then I block. wants me to feel a certain way about this. No, nope, that's definitely not it. Do this. Do all this. Do all this. I think I've... It's the same problem I had before. Um... Man. It's this looping thing here. It's maybe just... Thinking too hard. Thinking way too hard. Okay, so... Things are connecting over here. Uh, try myself. Bulbs. Like I said, these these puzzles are pretty intuitive, so it's just kind of there, there's kind of like a natural feeling about how to solve the, them. Doesn't mean I'm necessarily right, but. getting the angle. Yeah, 
you know, in some ways the environment's pretty telling about what you should be doing too. Like there, what like there's no know? things in here Pretty that natural. aren't. Looks to me like you set it down entirely, which makes a lot of sense now that I think about it. Never imagined how much the anchors would mess with the ship's systems when the others installed them. I guess they really fried some circuits down there, huh? On the bright side, I do now appear to have full access to the annex you're standing in. Now, I know it's a big ask, considering we just met and I've already insulted you, but if you keep shutting down the anchors like that, I might have a real chance at getting out of here alive. What do you say? Oh, let me grab those doors for you. Well, thank you. Let's explore a little bit. There's kind of a puzzle solution there or something. So we got another puzzle thing going on. We can actually uh, return to the ship and uh, you can just kind of resume your progress. So being able to just kind of hop in and out of puzzles at your leisure uh, or leisure uh, if you're if you say it that way uh, I think is really cool like it, it feels like uh, the witness in some ways. Um, I'm trying to see what else there could be comparisons to. I uh, don't know what's going on here. I don't know, given the, well, you know, there's like two people talking to each other, so there's, you know, there's some elements of Firewatch here, maybe? It's a really pretty game. Yeah, this looks cool. I, I'm very interested to see more of this game and kind of put some real progress into it. But for the time being, I think this is a game that you should definitely be uh, wishlisting and looking out for um, when it gets closer to release and, you know, it's happening sometime uh, between now and March. Um, so we'll kind of see where this lands, but for a puzzler strategy game that's indie, this this is really cool. It's really fascinating. It's, it's definitely grabbed me. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a link to the store page in the description. And uh, I'll talk to you next time.